Hey guys, Pokemon Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon have been announced to release on November the 27th this year. As the Pokemon fan I am, I decided to make some videos about the reveals of the new games. So these videos won't be reactions to the trailers. This is going to be a video where we analyze and speculate about what has happened in the trailers. So let's get into the analysis for the trailer first. At first, we see a shot of the trainer in its room, with new clothing that wasn't available in Pokemon Sun and Moon, as well as some books, a signed picture, and a Nintendo Switch. Then on the second shot, we see that the player will most likely live in the same house as the player in Sun and Moon, as well as a surfing board and some colorful plants. There are some people that say that the Wingle you see might be following the player, but I think that it's just an overworld Pokemon that flies that way when you go there for the first time. There's a new Pikachu Paradise in both the direct trailer and the YouTube trailer. I am not sure if this is a new area, but I think it is and it might be on Mele Mele Island. Also, we can clearly see a trial person standing in the back there. So I believe that trials are not going anywhere. The shot of the Mimikyu attacking is very cool. This might just be a Mimikyu exclusive Z move. I do think Mimikyu is one of those Pokemon that deserves its own Z move. Obviously, we have new forms of Solgaleo and Lunala, or of Necrozma, where they fuse together. And the last part of the trailer shows the player twisting a Z crystal on its black Z ring. It makes me believe that this is the Z crystal to either one of the new legendary forms. At the final screen, we see the new logos, which kind of look like eclipses in a way. So now we have analyzed the trailer, let's do some speculation. First of all, in the direct, this line of text was said. These are definitely versions, perfectly suited for the title Ultra. Which makes me think that the new legendary forms might be called Ultra Forms. As well as that, they also said that there are going to be new Pokemon. Now I don't think this is referring to actual new Pokemon, but just to Pokemon new to the Alola region. And maybe some new Alolan forms and Ultra Beasts. I've got a list of Pokemon that I would love to see in the Alola region. If you want to know what this list is, tell me in the comments below. This is all I have for now, but I would like to know what you think. Tell me your opinions in the comments below and leave a like to show your support. Then I will see you in the next video.